Well, 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 I'm back. And I think it's time to go after the Mazari for their treacherous attacks on me. That didn't really amount to much, but whatever. Low, low load. I'm not sure if I was going to cut this out or not, the loading screen, but whatever. Alright, so. <clears throat> at this point, I basically have to deal with like these guys who basically decide to uh, turn on me. Last time I had uh, Kairos here join this army here, and we basically forwarded the attack by the uh, Mazari over here. I'm like, you know, um... Skane, I guess it is, that they attacked me at. They're probably doing this for their quest, but um, I'm not going to let them get away of attacking me like that, so they're going to pay. Pay dearly. Alright, cool. We're building our burrow here in the uh, recently captured forgotten area. Build this. This game building our burrow. We can build one more burrow here, perhaps. More like a build our burrow. Build that there, I guess. Still got this proliferator in here, I gotta remember. Alright, got the uh, Sister of Mercy hero down here. She's basically moving her way back up, you know, toward this area. These guys are moving out to basically attack the um, stuff out here. I'm tempted to attack these guys right now, but it makes more sense for me to uh, avoid them for now. You know, think about it, it might actually be a good idea to actually start, you know, building up um, units here. And more on lack and skein. Alright, these guys. So, I'll note at this point, um, these guys are at me and they have like lots of units in their cities. What I'm likely going to do is I'm going to have like these guys just sort of like, you know, heal up my territory. So basically I want to make them sit in a town, like say over here. And I'm probably going to attack over here at uh, Bolt Air when I get the chance. Ah, oh, good, this has gone away, so now I can get my guys to regenerate a little bit. And... This is a city that's like, as far away from the action, so... Apparently I missed a, um... A ruin there to explore, whatever. Let's build that there. We'll build this.
Dogger can always build more burrows, I guess, because it's nice and big. Build that there. Build those next, I guess. You guys get to move up over here. Nice thing about her army is that it's actually got room to put the uh, proliferator in it, so... Maybe I'll do that. You guys move up over here. Apparently these guys decided to move away on me, so... I remember it was like land over there to explore whatever. Let's attack over here. And you know, at this point, I'm not gonna borrow with like, you know, these battles. I'm actually just gonna go in here, we'll attack. I'll make a new battle born. Actually makes sense to drop both the battle borns here. Just I won't get the chance, but whatever. Oh, here's winter. So this is bound to happen at some point, and it's decided to happen now. We'll deal with that in a bit. I should really start getting these things now, I guess. The rare metal foundry and the uh, advanced harvester. And more burrows here might be a good idea. There's a hydromole deposit over there, apparently. Carrot! My capital! You can build a burrow right there. Alright, I have to think a little bit about how I'm going to do this attack, but, um... I guess we're going to do it, we're going to have these guys sort of come up from the bottom. And these guys are going to start sieging for now. Cool, these guys decided to come and attack me, so... get to go in there. You guys get to go here. Why not? We'll just go all this. That's uh, done. Now I have to start keeping in mind that I have like these like you know resources like you know the blood crystals which I can use to get more attack when I need to for my guys. I'm not yet using it, but it's something I might want to use in the future. And I have a certain over here at some point that I want to get into my empire, but... God, deal with other stuff first. You guys go up here. It's gonna take a while to um, take down this uh, fortification in Balter, so it's a good idea I'm seizing right now. Yep, oh, apparently someone increased my population in Moronlac, so that'll hurt a little bit. It's probably these guys down here being an asshole, the uh, pink guy. He has a spy bot. Let's 
Let's move these guys up here. Now, it's worth knowing, I'm actually thinking about buying some more heroes, and the heroes I'm thinking about buying are like this guy right here. Never rest. If I buy this guy now, that'll give me another Nick Face hero for my armies. So maybe I'll do that right now. And it basically, the reason I'm buying this guy is that I can stick him in this army here, for example, and he'll be useful this is basically to, you know, be like another hero to, like, you know, make my eyes a little bit stronger, shall we say. So I can drop this guy in here. Probably should have gotten some stuff first, but whatever. We'll deal with that when I get to it. Alright, there's the System Mercy going up over to uh, that part of the territory. Give me a few dryers on this territory over here to, to attack, but whatever. All this battle. Got myself an extra Battleborn apparently here. So now I got more Battleborns over here. Stick that Bellborn there. There's a the rare metal foundry, that'll be good for getting stuff. Erno can build another bro perhaps in the Admantium right there. Apparently I've got Hyperium up in this territory too. Deal with that in a bit. Now, it's interesting that this city here, the one that's like, you know, down here in like the middle of nowhere, it's basically got all the stuff built that you really need to get built in it, so... I'll basically start building it up like population wise, I guess, at this point. And then maybe we'll start building like military units in it. Okay, I'll basically go down 59 for vacation now when, I, when I'm basically doing stuff. We'll get these guys nice and close. Now, I bet if I attack these guys, I can still wipe out these guys easily enough, so... Massive auto! And we'll just drop a whole bunch of these guys that is made into, uh... Their own army. There's no lack of Battleborns that are being made at this point. This is one of the things that, you know, I had to watch out for if, like, you know... Money-wise, basically, it's going down a little bit as I get, like, more military from these guys. Like, you know, being made, the Battleborn. And by the way, this good thing about this is that I can now use, like, this to build up a Seraton right here. If I build that Seraton, I can, like, you know, simulate them the next turn. And you guys can go this way, I guess. If you don't stop harvesting pearls, we should be forced to consider harvesting you. Alright, so we're apparently a cold war with these guys again. The, uh, Forgotten. I was at truce for a while, but now they're able to attack me if they want to. Nothing really to say about that. Build that there. You guys can get that close.
If I was attacked, would I be in range with these guys, I wonder? I am in range, so that's good enough. And these guys are getting really injured over here, but whatever. They're still alive. There's a room right there if you get to at some point. Gotta remember that. And apparently it's the uh, the broken moors that decreased my population in more than lack, so. That's what's happening to them. Alright, so at this point, um, my, like, boost just went, went off for wine. Probably a good time to do these now. And I can go down here and get the serotonin in here. This is gonna be a nice little defense per, you know, things pacified. And if I want to, I can build dry units at some point. Maybe I'll do that. We'll let these guys for now. Let's give them their better claws. So these guys are like, you know, claw wielders. As odd as they are, they're basically, you know, insects with claws. And... Give them that stuff. It's odd with the Nickerfish. It's not really good to usually build like these, like, you know, types of units that basically, like, are from the minor factions because they get, like, so um, disease ridden from, like, you know, the attacks from these guys. <clears throat> Unless it's like a silic, which is disease immune, or other units you know, are disease immune. Alright, you get to go... ...over here. There's a little bit of dust. I guess dust is always worth it. I think I'm gonna attack these guys here, the um The what you call it's the Hernas for the quest that you're in here. You know, think about about spies. Maybe I'll start sending my own spies out. Is there any like really good spies here? And there's another sister of mercy here apparently for about her requirement here. Eh, whatever, won't worry about it. Alright, um, at this point, these guys are attacking me. Because, you know, only way to basically survive is to try and do as much damage as possible before I attack them. Really, they should just let me, uh, you know, attack them, but whatever. So he's got Marines over here, he's got Hernas over there. He's got Kairos over here. Look at these guys over here. Alright, basically the plan here is I want to try and lock down the guys that are like the archers here. Where possible. You guys are just gonna charge forward, you're just gonna go up to here. We're gonna go up there. Sure, try and get to those hernas. You can try and get to them as well. Just charge toward those guys. And let's go with that. 
So the battle begins. Now luckily these guys are in a forest, so we're gonna take some defense from these guys. Defense criticals, I think. Here's the first attack on these archers over here. More attacks on them. You're gonna lock down the militia. Ooh, he got all the way up on the hill, that's cool. And you heal up from your duration a little bit. Nice, you got close enough to hit those guys. And instantly killed the Hernas. There was those Marines. And odd, oh, they're gonna attack these guys over here, so. That rope worked out really well. Uh, if possible, I want these guys to hit these guys. Because these guys are going to get hit by these guys, but whatever, I guess. Ah, hell, let's go. Kill! Kill! Pretty much. There was that militia. You're gonna bless someone. Oh, cool. She just bless herself, I guess, or that's from the heal regeneration. Never mind. These guys are crawled toward these guys now. Ow! That's painful. That's a little bit of damage to those guys. I was hoping those guys would die there, but whatever. Just be it for them. Last battle here. There goes those Marines. to heal someone. No, you'll attack. Never mind. I didn't even have to use the militia there. I didn't even get a chance to come out. And I'll think about I should probably start using these stockpiles and stockpiling up quite a bit. Maybe we'll use him on Erno a little bit at this point, Osterex. So. Yoink. And Osterex will go yoink. And apparently, you got a level, so cool. I apparently want to go over here to get the um, Indiana Bones so I can basically go for Benediction and Sisters to get this, you know, up a little bit soon. One bad thing about her, you know, starting off that, like, you know, skill point, it basically prevented me from getting the other good stuff that she could have gotten. But whatever. That's my scene now. So, this is now my territory over here. Balter. 
think I want Balter in the beginning, but whatever. It's now mine. You guys move over here. You guys can follow the system mercy over here. I'm gonna build that central market here. I'm probably gonna buy some stuff in Belter, I think, like the central market. Build that right there. I got the altar of Aruga here, so I can like level up a little bit. I think if uh, it goes to level two. Erno decided to get construction done. Let's put this up here. We'll buy that now. Don't know those ghost guys over there. Auto! Alright, so sell the suit by killing these guys. I got myself exotic armor for that. An item. And let's see, I think I'll send these guys toward the, uh, the vine snakes over here. You guys have to go over here. You guys have to go over here. Always fun. Warm summer is back. The lushness and greenness is back. These winter effects suck. <clears throat> Let's get single corpse at this point, I guess, and then we'll get the uh, brigade system. Whoop, you went pretty far. You can go over here. Now if I attack here, they didn't range the guys in Erno, I wonder. Hey, everyone's in range, cool. Alright, for this battle, I'm actually gonna go to um Basically, cause my necrophage. This, you know, this guy is already in the battle to stay away because he's a little bit injured. So, you stay away from this battle. You gotta get up a little bit more. Get the whole lot from this fight. You get to attack up here. Move there. You get to move here. Let's do it. First attack. 
Wow, I nearly killed that surgeon right there. Big attack there. There was that certain. Oh, my bell barn getting attacked down there. My proliferator to attack this guy, I guess. Now let's just launch the attack, let it go. Let's see how this goes. One attack. Two attacks. Three attacks. There's a dead Seraton right there. Oh, almost dead Seraton there. That one's dead. Now, if I'm lucky, I can probably get in our Bellborn just by, you know, proliferate attacking him. More Battleborn for my ranks. Now, I know at this point the Battleborn are getting kind of weak, but there's one good thing about them in that they're basically really, really good for use in, like, you know, uh, sieging down, like, you know, fortifications and such. There's lots of fortifications I can use them to basically, you know, mob it down real quick. All right, I don't need those Balborns in this here, so they all get out. And I get a chance to build up the uh, Seraton one more time. Right there. Ah, uh, we'll put that there. Build that too. All right, so I'm thinking at this point, maybe I want to build like some more stockpiles in these guys. So Urkno gets more. Asterix gets more. Now, I guess these guys will send them back toward Austrich, uh, um, Ostara server for now. They sort of served their purpose. So these other guys are going to send them over in this direction to... Uh, basically explore, I guess, over here.
And lots and lots of bros get built again. Let's build one more bro here in uh, my capital. I'll build a dust bar down here. Build this. You know, at this point, I should just buy a whole lot of titanium and uh, glass steel if I can. We'll make it a little bit easier for building stuff if I want. Okay, you go up here so you can attack these guys. And here's their capital. So he's got eight units of his capital right now, the uh, guys here. Mizari. Took me a few turns to siege it down, but it's fine. You were nice enough to build some stuff. Hmm. That's like right there. So we're just gonna build that right there, I think. Send you up over here, I guess. And why not? We'll keep building more and more in this city, I guess. Build that right there. Ooh, I got Mif right up here. That's cool. We'll build that first, actually. I actually really should be building a dust uh, transmuter and a cryometrics monitor thing that I want to build at some point in these cities. Um, the best thing for science, I guess, right now is uh, Daragar, and for money as well, it's um, Daragar, so... We'll set these to build. Get all done real quick. And Balter! You got this right there. You got right that there. Uh, you can build, you know, another burrow here, I guess. Why not? A lot of stuff I can build there. Alright, a test of strength. So it looks like there's a giant um, guardian in Ukiman. Apparently it's being peaceful, but whatever. Divine snakes are attacking me. Someone's increased my population more lax, so it's probably the uh, Broken Lords again. You know, if they're gonna keep doing that, there's actually something I can show off. Basically, we're gonna go here more lax, and I'm actually gonna go do a roundup. So basically this will cause like, you know, spies to be flushed out of the city. And four turns will basically possibly flush out the, you know, Broken Lord spy. You guys go down here. Get to go in there. I'm going to stick, um... My hero over here, I guess, uh, never rests. You get into the water. I 
we're still sieging down over here. Austria still needs to build stuff, so... And this is the thing, right? Where am I supposed to build burrows here if I want to? Really nowhere. I guess I'll build that there, but that'll probably be the last one. I can't build any more burrows really in this little confined area. Build that there. We'll build this. Cool, we built that stuff. Let's send these guys up to join one of these, like, you know, armies. Join the System Mercy Army, I guess. And you get to go here. There. I want to just go over here. We're going to explore around this little island out in the middle of nowhere. Let's see, should I have to worry about you, I guess. Cool. Oh, they decided to attack me, so I'll have to be dealt with. Let's build that there. We'll build this. It's too bad I can't keep, get this guy to join the battle, but whatever. Basically, notice that this guy can't enter this this realm now because, like, basically, it's like you know, obstructed from him. That's annoying. Let's look at that. You can go down here. So Norgashi apparently on this island. Nurgash right there, too. We'll crush him. Yes. Alright, well. The battle for the um, Mazari's capital, so to speak. Let's just auto it. Pow. Nothing to it. And I've got over units that, you know, I really don't need to have, so... There goes that. Uh, let's see here, you guys can go... Well, up here, I guess. Put these guys here, so I have, like, you know, less guys in this army. You know what, let's just start moving over here with these guys, I guess. Mine! All mine! I think this will probably be what's it for this episode. I'm gonna end it.
So, the Mazari have been beaten back by two territories. I know at this point my, my approval battle is going down because, you know, I'm conquering all this stuff, so that's an issue. But I can also buy out, like, you know, resources for next time, so that'll help. I'm go skiing here, we'll build a little bit more stuff. Build that there. Build dust refinery. Build that. I'm gonna say that's probably gonna be it for this uh, this play session. We we might actually go a few turns, basically conquering a little bit of the Mizari. You know, moving around my massive armies. This is like sort of how Nigger Face Turret gets played, you know. Basically, you're moving around arms a lot more, and like, you know, with like, say, like a, a Volter faction, which basically is sort of turtles up and like stays at home. Ten episodes in, I've only basically got 115 turns. It'll take a while, but you know, I'll basically ram buckle my way through all this stuff easily enough. Take care for now.